Every resort town in the U.S. has a candy store, but one store in Pismo Beach, California, goes beyond the usual taffy and caramel apples. If Hotlix has its way, Americans will be snacking on everything from caterpillars and cockroaches to mealworm-covered apples. Larry Peterman is a candy man on a mission. For more than a decade, he's been promoting a valuable food source that most Americans find revolting. In a land of plenty, people resist. Larry knows why. From an early age, parents teach children to avoid insects. In our culture, from the time that we're really small, uh, we're taught to avoid insects. Uh, they might bite you like a mosquito or swat them. This has got, got a good cricket in it. But kids aren't the only ones munching on bugs. Around the world, more than 1,400 insect species show up on menus. Insect eating, or entomophagy, is part of healthy diets in Asia, Africa, Australia, and Latin America. This trend is anything but new. Archaeologists have found evidence of it dating to the earliest humans. Advocates of insect eating like to note that it's environmentally sound. Producing a pound of caterpillar takes a tenth of the resources needed to produce a pound of beef. And insects brim with vitamins and minerals. But despite all the benefits, most Americans can't stomach bugs. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Have a seat. Have a Unlike Larry Peterman, yeah. who celebrates them at his dinner oh, parties. Gentlemen, the evening begins with Larry's version of the classic shrimp cocktail. We just finished preparing a cricket cocktail. It's a lot like a shrimp cocktail, only instead of shrimp, we use crickets. OK, folks, here's the first course. Now enjoy. While you're enjoying this, I'm going down and get your next course. The main course is a stir fry, a special garnish. Here we go. Dinner is served. Yeah. Like hey, here we go. Ready? Okay. Uno, dos, three, go. Soy sauce? Oh, man, there's a bunch. He loves a cricket. <laughs> Several courses later, Larry presents his piece de resistance. Event and dinner I've had. Okay, here it is, folks. Uh, what you've been waiting for? This. Oh. Uh, <laughs> now, don't let anybody dive in until everyone's been served, please. <laughs> we call him a Pismo surfer. What it is is a banana with whipped cream and a really good cockroach on there. You don't have to eat the wings. You don't have to eat the head unless you want to. Do you know? Do you know where this cockroach has been? Hopefully <laughs> 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 not. Please. We could do another one next week if you like. Larry predicts he'll eventually win people over. As we become more and more insect food oriented, our taste is going to change. And so I see uh, a niche for somebody that, that does gourmet insects. Could have some snob appeal, like people taste wines. Mm, this is a good one. This bug is good. <laughs> <laughs> 